Uh, the subject of this Saturday morning science is uh, heterogeneous bubble nucleation. And in order to show this, we need to have a, a couple of spheres of liquid. So I'm going to, we're going to demonstrate making these spheres. And here we have the, the two dimensional beaker, which is the Ziploc baggie. We poured a little water in it. There's the water, and there's one drop that got away, and we're catching it there. And now, to make these spheres of water, we're going to first start off by making a two-dimensional film. And I found that uh, this is this technique works really well. To first pull a film like this, and then you can inflate the film to make a sphere. And here I'm showing a side view of pulling one of these films, and you can see that the service tension wants to make make the film fairly thick. And this film there, as as it's leaving, is probably two or three millimeters thick. And what you can do is you can stick the bag back on it, and and you can use the the curvature of the meniscus next to the bag to suck the water off, so it's of the order of a half a wire diameter. And and that's what we have there for that particular film. And of course, this is all in the process of, of making a, a sphere of water, which is uh, 50 millimeters of diameter, which is the diameter of that loop. And here I'm adding water to that film so I can inflate that thin film into a sphere of 50 millimeters in diameter. And before we were making these by basically blowing out a big sphere of water, then trying to lasso it with the with the loop. And this is by far the easiest way to make a big sphere of water. And after you pull it, you let it sit for a while uh, for the oscillations to die out. And here is the, the same thing, only from a top view, where uh, the film that had been previously pulled, looking uh, straight down into the loop, is being inflated uh, with uh, with a, with water until it forms a sphere again about 50 millimeters in diameter. And these spheres are are just the the means to the end, which is heterogeneous bubble nucleation.